Well, our referee standing them both up again. And away they go once more. For the first time, Peter Cray looks tired. Yeah, you can see the gum shields coming out of his mouth almost. Oh, and he's back on. He's back on now. He's got his butt. Wow. And you can hear, listen to that wow. response to the upright war that suddenly comes in the third. Amazing, electrifying atmosphere. And Wesley, it's Shelford that says, I don't want any more upright. Big turning point in this third round for Peter Cray. Peter just needs to keep on the pressure. Keep on the pressure here. He's, he's almost cracking Glenn. That's the term, crack, because Glenn has been so calm and so dominant. But that upright exchange, he suddenly, at one point there, said, I want no more, dropped to draw Peter Cray in. Do you think Peter should have maybe stayed up and made him stand up again? Exactly. If I was in his corner, I'd be saying, play with him, let's see what he's got on his feet. And you can see that was a little turning point for Peter. Yes, the best moments of the fight so far for Peter Cray. And it all came from that tired look on his face. He took that kick and as if it suddenly shocked him into going again. And boy, was his response strong. But once again, we're in the scenario with Glenn Shelford in dominant position with Peter Cray on his back. And I said, I think it was an opportunity missed for Peter when Glenn went to the floor. I'd have taken three steps back and got the ref to bring him back upright and had another go at him. Well, I think Glenn's kind of get some space there to maybe utilise the guillotine and the ref stands him up. And you can hear the crowd response to that. I think the crowd realise this is Cray's best opportunity. Definitely. They're loving this one, Wesley. They're absolutely loving this fight. You can, see Peter, sucking. You can see Peter sucking it all in. Yes, trying to draw Glenn Shelford on. And again, I think that's a good tactic by Glenn Shelford. He didn't want to risk that again. Lord Peter, and you can hear the disappointment from Cray's fans, but for me, I think that was an excellent tactic by Shelford. Shelford's more or less got this fight now. He wants to just control him. He doesn't want to stand with Peter because he can see Peter's got some bombs. So, tactic was right, I think. 